Did you pile on any extra pounds when you were on I holiday? Did. I put on uh, about seven pounds, six or seven pounds. All beer. Uh, probably, <laughs> yes. But actually, no, it was all right until I got on the train. And, you know, it's just one of those things. The food is so good, you just have to eat everything in sight. So, no, you don't yeah. Have to, but well, now, are you willing diet. to admit it or are you, are you in denial whenever you gain weight? If so, you wouldn't be alone because apparently one in four overweight Brits refuse to acknowledge their bulging waistlines. Have you ever been in denial about how you're looking or have you ever told someone that they weren't looking quite as good as they thought that they were? Oh, that's just cruel. <laughs> um, no, I... Um, Did you I know that you were as when large I was as you really, were at really, your largest? Yes, all right, Jackie. <laughs> um, yes, when I was very, very huge, I suppose I was in denial because I just didn't look in a mirror, you know, lower sort of than below, that. There was right. no mirrors in my house other than that. And once you've got your makeup on and your hair, you think, oh, I look all right, and you just ignore the rest of it. <laughs> mm. So I never had mirrors, and I was one of them that I was never in the photo. I'd always take the photo. Very when clever. there'd be a photo, I'd go, oh, I'll take it, because I didn't want to be in it, because I hated looking you at photos. You yourself? No, God forbid. Ever? No, you just guessed it, you wait. Yeah. yeah. Oh, I'm at... L Do you know, I think I've gone up to nine stone. <laughs> <laughs> just leave the one off the front of it. You know? um, so, uh, <laughs> um, I so like yes, that. I was, but I think when I lost weight, it made me realise how much in denial I was yes. at the time. And also, you do that confidence thing of, well, I'm happy in my size. You know, I'm happy being big, and I was always on here cracking the jokes about being big. But actually, it is a bit of a defence mm. mechanism. Cause I, it definitely I, is. And when I'm you do not, look back I at sort of photos, happy. you think, oh, God, I was really quite a big yes. girl. Then. You were a real yeah. porker, weren't you, at one stage? Thank you, Carol. Yes, I was. <laughs> At the time, I didn't she think did so. It herself. No. I, didn't, I didn't think so at the time. In fact, my friend Michael, when I lived in in the states, and it's you know he's sort of like a body fascist. So you put on half a pound, and mm. he's calling the food police. But um, he used to say to me, "You have a disease." And I was like, "What? Oh, what?" He's you have an eating disorder called faborexia. You look far. You think you look far better than you actually do. Oh, <laughs> yes, that's a good term, isn't it? Faborexia. Faborexia. Yeah, so it's it's only denial. when you look back. Yeah. And you, you know, yeah. that you realise that you was right. quite portly. But I always hope that I've got that. You know, when people say they look in the mirror and they have a bad self-image and they, they're perfectly normal. They see themselves very thin. Sort of. Like, well, I always look in the mirror and think, that's all right. No, I'm sure it's all right. I'm sure it's fabulous. Now, I'm growing by the minute. And then I go and put on a pair of very baggy trousers with an elastic waist and go, look at that. Look. <laughs> And then especially on a holiday when you come back and you're going to put on your jeans and you cannot get them further than the top of your knees. And I, the trouble is that I'm so hot and I've got uh, suntan lotion on. It's all sticking to my trousers. That's great. <laughs> so you put your baggy ones back on. Do you ever tell... I'm sure you've never had a weight issue, really. Would you well, ever I tell have, people... I, I did used to be quite um, big, much bigger, about two stone heavier. But I knew that because I weighed myself. I was never in denial. And I did used to spend hours, well, I still do, looking at myself in the mirror with no <laughs> clothes on. And I used to look at myself and think... That's revolting. You know, do something about it. And so, so I did. But, you know, right now, it's not so bad. But would no, you ever tell anybody would, else? No, 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 never. You can't. People, she you know, is boy, such a liar. I, I, <laughs> do you know what? When I was at my heaviest, and we'd all be sitting there, and a topic would come up about weight or something, and she would go, Oh, I don't know. Ask Tubsy. She'll know. <laughs> on the end. That's I really what she's know. saying. Isn't she she yes. doesn't do it in a cruel way. I, but you don't mind me calling you tubby. Can we I just like put it. that on the record? No, I don't, don't now. I love it. it. Well, Especially just as well. Not tubby I know. As well. But just as well, because it wouldn't have stopped her. Time for our first.